last year we had an amazing physique unboxing here on GCM where we were able to reveal exclusively their entire 2018 range. And now, brilliantly, we're gonna to get to do it all over again. Not 2018, 2019. You lot are gonna be the first people to see this huge selection of 2019 goodness. And despite the fact that it's a world exclusive, you are still gonna get the opportunity to get your hands on some of it. Yeah, and not just one of you as well. Five people are gonna win. You wanna see what's coming up? Well, we have all new shoe models and Physique have redone their entire collection of bar tape. Now, I'm a huge fan of new shoes. I don't know who isn't, but actually, I'm weirdly excited about this as well, because I've learned an awful lot going through that, and hopefully you will too. We do have to start somewhere though, and predictably perhaps. I'm gonna start with shoes, and the blingest of the bling, the Infinito R1 knit. Here we go, look at that. When I say knit, I mean knit. These are made with a unique knitted fabric, okay, which has got different densities of weave in order to tailor in different properties to different parts of the shoe. So perhaps increased stretch in one place, increased support in another. And then that upper is bonded on to the proven carbon physique sole. I say proven with good reason. I'll tell you more about that in a second. Now, technically, the R1 Infinito knit is not new, new, because this one, Eagle Eye viewers will remember, was actually launched last year, this very stealthy black with red low lights colorway, but it has been joined by some brothers and sisters. The gray, and this was indeed the same model of shoe that Geraint Thomas used when he won at this year's Tour de France. So when I said proven, I mean proven. We've then got petrol blue and, you know, it's yellow or green? Let me consult my box. Yellow. We've then got petrol blue and yellow. And then last but not least, <laughs> purple and blue. And yes, if you've been paying attention to your GCM videos, you will also know that these are the ones that I chose. Yeah. Let us remove this peloton of shoes to make way for some completely new ones. Ha. This is the Tempo range. We have two models here. We've got the Tempo Overcurve and the Tempo Power Strap. So that is the Overcurve. Ooh. And that is the Tempo Power Strap. Now, you wouldn't know it, I don't think anyway, to look at it, but these are actually the entry points into the physique shoe range. When you look closely, you will see that instead of having a carbon fiber sole, they've got a nylon sole, which means it's a little bit heavier perhaps, and also ever so slightly more flexible, which to be fair, on the flip side, some people feel gives a shoe a little bit more comfort. Now with the Tempo Overcurve, which is this one here, the reason it gets its name, Physique say, is because of that asymmetrical upper. You can see that the, th the throat of this shoe, which is a new term for me, uh, goes from the inside of the foot to the outside of the foot. And it's designed that way, again, Physique say, in order to fit nicely around your ankle bones. The shoe, as you can see, is closed by a boa closure there, and also a Velcro strap at the forefront. And they don't just come in this rather natty white and red color combination. They also come in black with a little bit of pink, black with a little bit of fluoro yellow slash green. They come in, I like these ones, white with a little bit of black and black with a little bit of black. Let's add to our peloton of shoes off screen. Rapidly running out of room here and move on to our Tempo Power Strap. Now, would you believe it? These actually retail for even less than the Overcurve, which when you look at them, I think it's absolutely bonkers. Those are super, super cool. The reason they're called the Power Strap refers not just to the fact that it is a Velcro closure as opposed to BOA, but also that that strap extends around the whole of the foot. The theory being that instead of it just pulling the two halves of the shoe together to close over your foot. Actually, that strap kind of hugs the whole of your foot, meaning physique say, you get better volume control in line with the more expensive shoes in the range. 
Like the overcurve there, you also get this nylon outer sole, and as well as this, again, I'm gonna say again, beautiful white and black colorway, you also have very nice navy and black, black with black, and also red and black. I am rapidly running out of room here, so we will move quickly over the Infinito R1, which stays the same, and it's kind of like my go-to shoe, I suppose. It comes in black, black and red, red and black. My personal favorite, the white, and then also the very cool Movistar edition, which we actually covered on the GCN show not all that long ago. In the R3 Aria range, which is kind of one down from that, we have a new colorway. Woohoo! Look at that navy blue and white. That is cool. Then we've got the R4B and the R5 Arctica, which is like the winter boot. That's kind of waterproof, insulated. Even the sole, in fact, gets a silver lining. Who doesn't want their sole to have a silver lining? Oh, yeah. Anyway, on that positive note, let's turn to bar tape. Now, Physique's bar tape is somewhat legendary, but as I mentioned at the beginning of the show, they've actually completely redone it for 2019, and we have a selection right here. Oh yeah, but don't worry, don't be bamboozled. It's actually a very simple and well thought out range. All we have are three different ranges within the whole bar tape range. So we've got Vento, which is like the kind of thinnest, most high performance, perhaps for your fastest, most experienced road riders. We've got your Tempo, which is like your classic bar tape. And then we've got the Terror, which is the thickest, most cushioned tape. And they've actually designed it specifically for those kind of off-road drop bar riders, okay? Now, within each one, there are different models. So we'll start with the Vento. They have the Microtex Tacky. Then we've got the Solo Kush, which is a little bit thicker at 2.7 millimeters. And that comes from, I'm gonna demonstrate with this, a slightly thicker layer of padding there. Still got the same finish, the same tacky rubberized finish, and also those ribs as well. Can I, I'm gonna demonstrate for you, ready? There you go. So, Microtex Tacky, Solo Kush Tacky. Now, these two examples are particularly loud for the trendiest of cool modern cyclists, but if you, like me, perhaps more traditional, then it also comes in black and white and red, as well as those fluoro options. Now, next up, as I mentioned, we have the Tempo range, okay, of which there are three. We've got the Microtex Classic, Microtex Bond Cush Classic, and Microtex Bond Cush Soft, okay? So, all very simple when you know. The Classic is the thinnest in the tempo range. Again, just two millimeters. And as you can see, the finish on it is literally what it says on the tin, classic. So it's got that perforated leather look, but Microtex is a synthetic leather. Now, the finish on it is not shiny, but kind of like a silk finish. So maybe it has marginally less grip, perhaps, than the tacky finish, but it looks super cool. And on the right bike, that is the absolute perfect choice. A low profile classic tape. And as well as it being classic in look, you also lose your fluoro option. So instead of the loud ones, you get more classic colors, perhaps like the orange and the honey as well. Then, we're still going. We've got the Microtex Bond Cush Classic, okay? So the Bond Cush refers to an additional layer of padding bonded to that Microtex synthetic leather outer. And that Cush, is 0.7 millimeters thick, so a little bit bigger, but otherwise the same finish. And you can see there, that is another classic. That's a silver finish, which again on the right bike is gonna look absolutely mint. Then finally, we've got the Bond Cush Soft, which is the same as the classic Bond Cush, so it's 2.7 millimeters, it's got a little bit of padding, but you'll see it's got a slightly different texture on the finish. So it's like, it's like a matte finish, so it's really hard to describe. It's kind of soft is probably the best description. Finally then, we have the Terror, which Physique have designed for those that take their drop handlebar bikes 
away from smooth tarmac, okay? It's also gonna be good for those with bigger hands as well, because it's the thickest tape that's available. Look, you can see, thin, thick. Quite significant there. Right, the reason being, that it has that Microtex outer in the same tacky finish actually as the Vento range. It's also got that Bond Kush mid layer, but then the extra bit is the gel backer on there as well. So that is a really soft cushioned tape, which is perfect if you're gonna be racing Paris Bay or doing the Paris Bay Sportif or something like the Dirty Kanza. And as well, actually, you've got to say, for gravel dudes, I think that green is, is quite fitting. Uh, also, Mildly in love with the navy blue option, as well as the classics of black and red and white. Now, hopefully, now you've seen all of this tape, all the terminology actually seems to make a little bit more sense. You have Microtex, which refers to the material of the outer. Bondkush tells you that there is that cushioned mid layer. And then in this case, the gel backer is exactly that. And that final word on the description, that refers to the finish, so tacky, it's like that rubbery feel. Classic is the kind of leather-esque finish. And then soft is the one that I couldn't really describe for you because it, it just kind of feels slightly soft. So there we go. I don't know about you, but I tend to buy all my handlebar tape online now. So actually that has been blooming useful for me. I hope that it has been for you too. Now, thankfully, for physique's sake at least, given how busy they've been designing new shoes and an entire range of bar tape, We'll gloss straight over the saddles because there isn't anything new on that side of things. If you want a bit more info on that, you could refer back actually to last year's 2018 unboxing and get all the information about that over there. For now though, I know you've been waiting patiently, you wanna know exactly how to enter that giveaway. It's pretty simple actually, you just head to the description beneath this video and click on the link. Boom, there you go. Best of luck, five of you remember can win a pair of shoes and three rolls of bar tape. Imagine that, three rolls of bar tape, you could go nuts. You could get different choices, different, you could get like white ones, you could get a black one, and just knock it out of the park, go for fluoro pink as well. That'd be pretty cool. Now, big thanks to Physique for sending all of these goodies through and giving us the opportunity to actually give some away to you as well, which is great. If you want a little bit more information about how to choose handlebar tape, John is gonna go into it in a bit more detail over on the Tech Channel shortly, so make sure you keep your eyes peeled for that. But still, actually, subscribe, and that way you definitely won't miss it. Make life easy on yourself. It certainly would be the sensible thing to do. And if you want a little bit more info, as I said, on the 2018 saddles moving into 2019, then refer back to that video we shot last year.